Oh, I feel like a news reporter, like a weather reporter. Welcome back to Channel 7 News. We're <laughs> at SeaWorld tonight. No. All right, you ready? Mm-hmm. G'day, guys. Welcome back. How are we? Uh, me and Alex both here tonight. I'm here. Yay! We're at SeaWorld for opening night of Carnival. Um, oh, today's opening night. I yeah. didn't even know that. Oh, I'm learning along with you guys. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're going to enjoy some food, uh, explore the precincts. I'm not going on any rides. I don't know if Alex is. I don't know. What's open? Everything's open. We will how long the way it is. <laughs> definitely be catching the Aquacolor light show after dark. Yes. Now, my shirt looks beautiful. You ready, Alex? If you guys want a shirt just like this one, check out, yes, check out Destination Dad and Daughter on Redbubble. If I remember, I'll leave a link in the description. Yeah, if I don't remember, then there won't be a link in the description. Just Redbubble, Destination Dad and Daughter. All right. We ready? Yes, because I'm hungry. You're hungry. <laughs> hungry already. And she, I, we walked in. She goes, oh, frozen margaritas. Let's get one of them. Frozen strawberry margarita. And there was also a pina colada. We were here a for like one. three minutes. Oh, here comes the music. Okay. All right. And <laughs> you ready? The earlier I start, the more I can have. There we are. Yes. <laughs> I'm not yes. the one driving. No, you're not. I am. All right. Let's go. Uh, so like we said before, uh, we haven't been here for a long time and this is the first time I've seen this. I'm guessing showers for when you're finished with your animal adventure. You can come and have a shower, clean all the salt water off yourself and uh, get changed back into your normal clothes. Alex is just standing there nodding her head. She doesn't <laughs> want to say anything because she's got the microphone clipped onto her top. <laughs> so beside the Dockside Tavern, they have uh, shrimp boil up. Banji may get that for dinner a little bit later. And then right beside it is uh, hot dogs. New York dogs, foot long for 16, or a uh, cup of six for 10 bucks. Probably won't be getting that, but uh, I don't know, sure. they both sound pretty appealing to oh. me. <laughs> Alex is hungry already, so yeah. uh, look at Fanji, she's eyeing off what's in the And there's up. corn in it. That's like the best part of corn seafood. Corns and corn. <laughs> I think that's all that's in it. Uh, there's potato. Crawfish. Prawn, potatoes, corn, sausage. Mm. 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 You say, mm, like, no, I hate love seafood. seafood. <laughs> Not five minutes later, and I have got my drink. It's very good. It tastes like straight to killer, uh, the aftertaste. Also, I'm quite curious about the portion sizes for that seafood boil because what is it? $21? $21. That's you think like. It'd be pretty big. No, for seafood, you would think that would be so small. Oh. Like, they charge $21 for like a burger and chips, which would usually cost anywhere else like. $15 maybe? So like $21 for like seafood? You have to wonder how much is in there. Probably not a lot. The Cajun Cantina street style nachos, $15. Uh, add some beef chili con carne or chicken for four bucks. Alex is thinking about getting nachos. No, I'm not. No, she's not. <laughs> Beside the village bean, uncle. Hungries? Mm. Bayou rice. Vegetable Bye. fried rice, $12. Chicken fried rice, $15. Yeah, Benji might be into that. We'll see. Well, uh, if only you can smell this. Uh, this could be the place I'm coming to eat. Some ribs. <laughs> uh, pork loin ribs and barbecue rub, 23. Chopped pastrami roll, 21. Uh, corn for 12 or plain corn for 8? What's the corn? Uh, fresh salsa, diced avocado and queso cheese sauce. And this smells 
delightful. Come on, Disney, bring out smell-o-vision. The food places have just opened, uh, 5.30. Already a big line for Bourbon Street. It's going to be a very popular one tonight, I think. All right, from Bourbon Street, I got the pastrami roll. It comes with coleslaw, potato salad, and corn. And Alex got my street corn with salsa and there's i don't know if it said guacamole or if it's yeah, it said guacamole okay guacamole but it's just avocado yeah that that looks pretty good mm. this looks really good mm. uh, i'm this one i want to try the potato salad 21 dollars for that and 12 for the corn mm. let's dig in I don't remember what the sauce was. <laughs> oh yeah. Cas quesadilla. Quesadilla. Quesadilla is a type of like burrito. Yeah. Queso, you mean. Queso. <laughs> <laughs> The potato, the potato salad on mine is delicious as well. It's nice and cold. It's very warm here. I'm like sweating. We're going for a little uh, trip into Africa now. As you can probably hear. Yeah. Sound effects really cool coming through the speakers in here. I'm probably being drowned out by the uh, sound. It's a lot less claustrophobic down this way. Oh. I don't know if that is just for carnival. It doesn't look like it. It doesn't, but ice cream nacho sundae, 12 bucks, it looks pretty good it's giving the echo yeah the strawberry oh strawberry <laughs> sunday from the exhibition yes looks all right rainbow sunday for 750. Mm. Uh, we came down here because we thought it would be africa but there is absolutely nothing down here it's just normal it's, cast away it's just based the music stuff and the flags. yeah music and flags and maybe that Sunday. Oh, there were some performers, like on uh, stilts. Yes, there. We might go and have a look at them now. Eh? There was a fire twirler standing right here. She has gone because the flames went out. And through the smoky haze, there you go. There's the uh, the drummers on stilts. A little band is coming our way, dancing around beside the stilt walkers. Oh, I thought they were coming our way, but they disappeared. The Storm Coaster is open. It's such a great little ride, this one. You do get pretty wet on it. Uh, but on a day like today, where it's stinking hot, well, it's not hot, it is disgustingly humid. Uh, no matter what you do, you just sweat. This would be a great way to cool off. line around there here they come no screaming ah, no screaming a lot of dancers out and about the street performers spell walkers some naughty kid up on the side gonna get himself into trouble Uh, so tonight, the Vortex has stopped working. Hello Alex. Don't know why the Trident is not going. The only thing going in Atlantis it? is... Yes, I have been on it. The only thing going in Atlantis is the uh, Leviathan. Probably won't be riding that after having that burger. Mm, that's um, how I'm feeling. The line is by no means massive for it, 
Uh, there's a bit of a queue on the inside, but probably half an hour wait, I would say. And uh, can't wait for the Aquacolor light show. Won't be watching the early one. We'll wait till it's completely dark before we go and watch that. Now we're going to head into Rio, have a little look around in there. Now that the sun's gone down a little bit, it's still disgustingly hot, but anyhow, can't control the weather, can we? There is uh, dancers down here in Rio, and you can probably hear the drum band. Those uh, flames, really hot. Second drink of the evening. This one has no watermelon though, it's just strawberry. Though it, it did say lime as well, but it just tastes like strawberry. It tastes less strong than the other one too, actually. Tastes good. Very sweet. Very sweet. There is uh, fire twirlers out here now. Gotta stay well clear of them, otherwise uh, you may get burnt.
Carnival done and dusted, opening night. Thoughts, Alex? Mm, my honest opinion? Yep, be honest. I get a little about. bit, bo whoa, I get a little, I've had too much alcohol, that's my opinion. <laughs> no, um, I get a little bit bored these days. They're not really switching anything up. Um, but I liked what I ate. Um, I probably should have eaten a little bit more, actually. I did also see somebody else's seafood. Um, there wasn't a lot of actual seafood in it, but the portion size was not that small of everything that was in it. Yeah, it was, Which, it was yeah. a fairly decent size. Mm. Uh, and I'm with you, nothing's really changed for the past. Like the first year was brilliant. And uh, Was since... Carnival the one that they had that like cob loaf the first year? Yes. All the way down the end? Yes. Yeah. Yes. That, so there was, was nothing good. down in Africa, no food at all, just a couple of dancers and a bit of a marching band. Um, the show is still nice, I think. Yeah, the, the show Aquacolor pretty... show was good, but it's the same show as last year and the same show as the year before. So it hasn't changed either. They need to switch it up a bit to keep people interested. Uh, I don't think tonight was a sellout either. So that probably mm. tells you that uh, people are losing a little bit of interest in the event. It's not finished now. It's only 10 past eight and the car park is starting to empty, empty out. out yeah. Just like us, we're about to bail because we want to beat the traffic. All right, hope you enjoyed a look at this. 
don't forget to hit that subscribe button give it a thumbs up check out destination dad and daughter on redbubble and uh i don't know where more than likely i will be next week because someone will be back someone's away. a workaholic yeah and it ain't me anymore <laughs> all right let's go home hero mm. oh Ooh.